Hello YouTube, welcome to my channel. In this tutorial I'm going to show you how you can flash your computer BIOS. So this is an Asus P5K Pro. We have to go to the website and download the, the BIOS firmware. Okay, so this is the latest version. This is an old machine, 10 years. So after the download is complete, you need to unzip the file to a USB drive in FAT. Plug it into your computer, press power, and then on your keyboard, press delete in order to access your BIOS. Okay, so now we need to move until tools and select ASUS easy flash select OK and if everything went OK the pen drive should be available so select your new ROM and press enter ok so the motherboard will check the new BIOS and will ask you if you want to proceed and update click yes so it's really important that you download the right BIOS for your computer because if you do a mistake you probably will break your motherboard because imagine that you are downloading a gigabyte BIOS and flashing a, an ASUS computer if you proceed with that probably you will break your motherboard so be careful with that okay so computer will restart we will boot again into BIOS so press delete again on the keyboard because the BIOS will be default and we need to select again the priority uh, for the hard drive so I was flashing a, a modified BIOS to this uh, ASUS motherboard because I need to run this new processor that I bought in AliExpress in order to be able to install macOS Mojave and this processor was really cheap uh, less than 20 euros and that is why we need a, a modified BIOS because this is one is socket 771 and we are on socket 775 okay so in order to be recognized and be used as full power we need a modified BIOS so I have done some research and I found a modified BIOS and that's the one I'm flashing on my motherboard okay so after flashing the most recent BIOS for you just want to upgrade your BIOS the computer will restart and boot normally okay and for me I will check now and I have the the new processor okay and you may see socket 771 and this motherboard is socket 775 so it's a modified processor that is why I needed a modified it BIOS with microcode and as you can see Mojave so I have a computer with 10 years able to run Mojave I hope you have liked this video and subscribe for more